move it, don't move it, don't move it. Don't move it, don't move it. Keep your feet on it. Keep your feet on it. Keep your feet on it. Yes, you can. Alrighty. So, uh, today is another day. Sorry the YouTube video came out today. It was like a YouTube video of me doing biceps. That video was supposed to be out yesterday, but I couldn't upload it. I had to go somewhere. So today the video's out now, and we'll be doing back and shoulders. I couldn't wait for this. Usually we do back first before we get to shoulders, because while we try to do a back exercise, that'd be a shoulder exercise before uh, back, that'll just end up making my shoulders weak whenever I try to do uh, a back exercise. Like if I'm trying to do pull-ups, my left and right shoulder are going to be weak and I'm barely going to be able to go up. That's usually what happens. And I got a pretty stuffy nose set. I was just outside uh, doing stuff with these garbage bags. I was just doing whatever. I don't got nothing to say about that. But I got I ended up getting pollen on my face while I was uh, taking the uh, the heavy-duty bags somewhere. And it ended up making my nose runny. But uh, we're done doing that now. Let's get to training. Okay, I'm trying to get this chain, okay, alright, the chain is finally here, the first weight, I'm going to add 45 pounds, right, and then, I guess I'll do 120, I'll do 120, yeah, I'm going to rep out 120 for two reps, okay, let's get this 45 pound dumbbell into play, okay, once we get this strapped up, we put the 25 pound dumbbell right there in that middle spot above the 45. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's freaking go. I got a headache. Ugh. Okay, let's take this weight off. Let's just do 45 pounds for reps. We don't need this. Oh, also, we're implementing, uh, what's to call it? Dumbbell rows again. But it'll be doubles, though. I'll be using two dumbbells instead of one. It'll be, I'll be doing bits over dumbbell rows with two dumbbells instead of one, because one takes forever. What I mean by forever, it takes forever to reach failure, basically. So I'm thinking, right, whenever we start to set a back, not back, pull-ups, I'm a medium to grip. So if y'all if, if y'all are not new and y'all usually see my back days, I usually go for close grip pull-ups, medium grip, and then completely wide until I'm, all, I'm, all, I'm completely done. I'll do two sets of failure each grip. So I'll do two sets of failure close. Two sets to a failure medium, where I'll just do one set failure uh, close grip, or one set to failure, so one set to failure medium, and then one set to failure long. But I'll do two each. Gosh, I'm out of breath, and I have a big headache for no reason. I do not know why. It started before I was even working out, so it ain't have nothing to do with the training. Oh. I think our only option now is to just do body weight. That's the only way I'm going to be able to get a lot more reps. So this whole time, we're just doing body weight from now on. We already hit our uh, PR weight for two reps, so let's move on. Let's do 
of pull-ups now. That was far, wasn't it? Oh yeah, these wild pull-ups are gonna be a ride for us today. Usually love doing wild pull-ups because they really engage your lats more, you know? More than any other back exercise for pull-ups, of course. But I feel like pull-ups is like the back ex the best back exercise you could do. It literally trains your whole back. Like, why are you, if you're not doing pull-ups, what are you doing? <laughs> 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 We locked in. It's all in the mind. <laughs> Let's do this bag exercise. What I was thinking about doing with these bent over dumbbell rows, I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about now. Glory to God. Glory to God. Tomorrow, we might be outside. It matters. It matters what I'm gonna do for back. But yeah, we'll, we'll go outside tomorrow. I got y'all on that. See y'all now. Well, see y'all in the next one. I was gonna say outro. It is the outro. <laughs>